Hey everybody, I'm Joey Hungerford, and this video is about our Disciple Making Pathway, which is an online cohort and missions mobilization tool that we host on our website in the description. So stick around if you'd like to learn more. So what is the Disciple Making Pathway? Well, the Disciple Making Pathway is an invitation to look back at Jesus's ancient original plan for his kingdom mission. It's also a challenge to look forward and to reimagine how that plan might fit in your moment and your context. The goal of the pathway is to see gospel saturation in your area and disciples making disciples through extraordinary prayer and fasting, living as missionaries, planting the gospel, starting discovery groups, and seeing multiplication. To achieve that, you'll be immersed in equipping, resources, mobilization, and teamwork, You'll also see new church paradigms and learn about revival movements of God around the world and their principles and tactics. You'll discover that there are ways of doing church that you've never even imagined before. You'll be introduced to viral, reproducible discipleship that has equipped high school girls, prisoners, even blind people to multiply churches. So reproducible, in fact, that you'll be able to take the pathway and with the principles, lead others and mobilize them to evangelize your area. I realized one day in my disciple making that if I wanted to go fast, I could go alone. But if I wanted to go far, I needed to go together. If I wanted to put a fire out, I could grab the garden hose and start spraying it. Or I could take a few extra minutes, call up the fire department and mobilize all those sleeping firemen to get out of the fire station, come down and put the fire out with me. And I realized that mobilization and going with the team was so much better than going alone. Now this isn't the next trend or church fad or program to go through and be done with or the big shiny new thing to copy from down the road. You'll realize that most of these lessons are a simple Bible passage that could fit on one page. The difference is looking at them with a fresh set of eyes that can lead to deep heart change and a lifestyle of transformation before the presence of God. But I warn you up front, in order to experience the deep heart transformation and the joy of this pathway, you need to do it for no other reason except obedience to King Jesus. Moving from unbelief to belief in Jesus in every surrendered area of your life. So I pray that through this pathway, you can take Jesus's yoke upon you following, learning, and apprenticing under the authority of His Word in deep lordship, surrender, and discipleship. God bless. It was really, um, it was really powerful in a lot of ways, very challenging. It, you realize there's so many different, you know, one, one size doesn't fit all. You know, it isn't just a cookie yeah. cutter. This has been amazing because it's giving me opportunities where I wouldn't have taken a step in relationship that I would have just gone, here's a, you know, uh, something for church. And hopefully that person will come. And instead, now I want to deal with relationships. Expanding who we can reach out to off of who we already know has a, like was a really good practice and reminder. And remember that this is God's work and this is the work that he's doing. Really opening my mind up to something I'd never really processed in that way before. So it's very exciting. I really like the program because it's definitely that idea of like, Here's something that you can work on. Here's a way you can go. Here's a way you can go. Because as we've said many times, like even how Veronica was just saying, like studying this one way with everybody won't always work. Everyone is very different. If people studied with me, how they studied with Veronica, I probably would have freaked out and ran away like it. And it just like, it helps with practice and it's all the different tools you get to use.